Okay, welcome back guys, turn green, go ham, and we are continuing on with our Bloodborne Arcane walkthrough. So, uh, as we found out in the last episode, killing Rom changed some things. For instance, we can't go to Cathedral Ward. Uh, there's a couple of areas that are open now, such as Yargol uh, Unseen Village. Um, our main uh, places that we want to go right now, um, there's a couple of uh, hunter tools we want to pick up for our arcane build. So we want the uh, auger, auger of Ebriitis. Uh That we're going to find in the lecture building on the first floor. So that's a quick, easy grab. Uh, we'll go ahead and um, make our way to the Nightmare Frontier Lantern from there. Uh, and then we're going to cut loose and we're going to go over to Yargle Unseen Village. Uh, the reason for that is to pick up a key to the Upper Cathedral Ward. Uh, and then we'll take on upper, uh, upper Cathedral Ward and the Celestials so that we can get our super overpowered arcane spell so uh basically this spell is going to make bosses uh look like chumps so uh first things first we need to head to the lecture building since grand cathedral is shut down we'll go to cathedral ward and run up and we got the tonsil stone earlier and that's what's going to allow us to get there Okay, I don't think she says anything different. Nope, she's uh just trying to figure out what's going on. Alright, let's run all the way up here. And then we're gonna go take a ride on the uh Amygdala Express. Excuse me, sir. Something's changed in there, and we'll find out later. These hunters don't respond, so don't have to worry about them. The high road is always the uh, safest route to get down. didn't go off as you can see uh, this sword is far more upgraded than our um, tinnitus with uh, better gems okay easy but the tinnitus one shots so uh, that's the difference the weaknesses can make let's go ahead and top off here because he's gonna drop us some Oh, nope, he dropped us a gemstone instead of some um, vials. Oh, well. So, we want this one to carry us off to the lecture building. Just stand here in front of the door like, uh, like you were trying to open it. Man, you're ugly. <laughs> oh, Amigdala. Oh, Amidala, <laughs> have mercy on the poor bastard. <laughs> Just another patches trick. If you remember, he's the one we got the tonsil stone from uh, back in the Forbidden Woods. Okay, lecture building. Let's get started here. We've got uh, a little bit to explore. There's not much to this area. Uh, there's a couple of pieces of lore. Uh, we'll get to talk to Patches for a minute.
what a joy it is to behold the divine. It must be such a pleasure. You're in my debt, you know. You're nigh on a beast of the field. But here you are, treading a measure with the gods. <laughs> are your feet as fat as your wits? Oh, cease this dithering. Take the plunge. Throw yourself to the wolves. <laughs> I don't believe he says anything different. Are your feet? Yeah, that's it. Okay, so let's start working our way through here. Uh, some of these doors are locked. Some of them you can get in. Yep, not this one. Is it this one? Yes. So in uh, this side. Nothing here, but we'll go in here and we'll get the key for the other side. As well as a uh, new outfit. Or part of one, anyway. Or I guess the outfit's in the other side. Uh, these guys are weak to bolt. One shot kill. Ah, there it is. Student, student uniform and trousers. Couple of doors here on each side. This one's gonna have kind of a trap waiting for us to drop down. Run in here. Some red jelly that'll uh, help with uh, dungeons, chalice dungeons. And where's our door? Now, this room has got a ton of these guys. They like to spit stuff at you. Like any nasty jelly man would. Hmm, little frame rate drop here. Fantastic. Even on the PS4 Pro. Hey, stop sleeping in class. Mm, maybe it's the upstairs that has the piece of lore, because it's in one of these rooms and I didn't see it while we were coming through. But this chest, this is why we're here. Augur of Ebriitis. So this is fantastic for when you're fighting uh, NPCs, hunters, um, other NPCs, anything like that. You get a little tentacle burst there. But the thing about it is, uh, it used to only do a little bit of damage. A little knockback. Uh, but now, uh, it actually can parry and leave them open for a visceral. Now, you can see that if I continue moving while I use it, it's got a lot of um, character locked down there. So, uh, getting the visceral afterwards is sometimes a bit of a challenge. Uh, hopefully you'll uh, kind of parry them towards the end of your animation. Uh, if that's the case, you'll definitely get the visceral. Uh, but for our build, we're doing a lot more damage with our weapons than we are with viscerals, so it's not really a loss uh, for us to not get the visceral. 
it's uh, much better to follow it up with a, a good strong attack. Now, on we go to the Nightmare Frontier. This place is a special kind of hell, but we'll get to it a little bit later. It's actually not that bad once you learn the area. You just have to come prepared. You need lots of antidotes and lots of blood vials, and you'll be fine. Uh, don't forget sedatives, but we'll get to all that later. Uh, we've got 34,000. How much do we need for a level? Very well, let me. 35. Do we have any cold blood? We do not. Farewell, good hunter. What a shame. Okay. We're basically running back to the same place where we just entered the lecture hall. Uh, but we're going through the door instead to get to uh, Yargle Unseen Village. Yargle, Yahargal, however you want to say it. And one more time through the crowd. Excuse me, sir. Oh, no. Not that rat. This rat. Man, it really sucks not being able to go to uh, Grand Cathedral right now. didn't hurt him but whatever oh that wind around stop blocking take your medicine oh those already went to the bank didn't they oh well Run past this guy, don't let him grab you again. We've already been there, don't want to go back yet. Why are you so bloody, dude? You can notice the blood explosions when I kill them. That's because of uh, them being charged up by the chime lady. It's all right, we're gonna take care of her lickety split. There's our lantern we grabbed earlier. There is a right side path, but it's probably after you go down. Well, you can drop here. We'll go here. Grab this. More chunks, always good. Those guys, we're gonna be dealing with all those guys shortly. First, we'll come down here and grab a couple items. Now, we will be coming back through here later as uh, by a shortcut but may as well take care of these guys while we're here clear them out don't have to mess with them when we come back i say that the chime lady's probably going to bring them back but we did get the item the yargle helm okay so run just run forget them all just run 
There's an amygdala there. She's gonna grab you. He he, whatever. But this is your uh, main objective right there. Once you kill her, all the other guys kind of stun. They lose their buff. Much easier to kill. Oh, easy, bro. guys want to play? No? Not really? Hey! I'm not going out on that uh, staircase because we'll get snatched. And it's not so bad here. Um, you, do, you just get sent up to the top. Just the completest enemy taking everybody out. Let's grab uh, the loot that dropped off of our chime lady here. And then open this cage. Little lore note on the floor. The mensis ritual must be stopped lest we all become beasts. And a bolt damp blood gem. I doubt it's better than what we have on our tenatris, but let's take a look. Bolt attack up, flat 16.5%. No extra positives, no extra negatives. Uh, I don't remember what we had on there. Bolt attack up, 18.8. Ken up, yeah. Um, our waning gym is way better. Okay, so each of these areas that you run to you're gonna have one of those uh, chime ladies it's not open yep that's right we go through here first uh, and she's empowering all these enemies so your main priority is always to get to the chime lady first excuse me sir oh where's the door there it is That stuns everybody, gives you time to start clearing them out. Come on. I know you can't fit through that door. Why can't I visceral him through that door? Alright, do a normal swing. Come on. Alright, just die. No blood vials from that guy. The air rune. Did we miss anything? Nope. Run up here, open this door. More of a straight shot through. Very minimal shortcut, but a shortcut all the same. Grab our Quicksilver bullets. And some frenzied frenzy cold blood. So this uh, Sinister Bell Lady is a little more difficult to find. You know where she is though, won't be a problem. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna need you to just calm down. Wait your turn. Hello, lock on, thank you. And first things first, we wanna jump down the middle here. And there's our upper cathedral key. So you remember the locked door at the top of the uh, cathedral tower? Now we can get there from here.
What you got? Oh, same thing. He's not gonna let me visceral him through the door. And you, no sir. We don't like guns. Just because you're handicapped doesn't give you the right. And here's another hunter tool. Tiny to nitrous. Now, this thing can be super powerful in the right... Um, if you use it in the right way. Uh, it's basically like... Uh, what was it? The... Black f flame snake from uh, Dark Souls. I'll show it to you once. It's expensive. We're only going to do it once. I think it's six or seven bullets. But if you get everybody lined up in a doorway and fire it off, you can just do an absolute crap ton of damage. Okay, so we only have one more Sinister Bell Lady in this area. But we do have another major threat to get past. Uh, one of these amygdalas has some extra powers. Oh! There's a lot more of you than I thought there was. Excuse me. Push over. No, no, no. Golly, with your hot poker stun. Man, too many of them. So we've got a little uh, bloodstone chunk around here. Uh, another way to take all those guys out, if you run down this next um, ramp here, the amygdala is going to start firing lasers at you, and you can actually make the amygdala kill these guys. So let's see if we can make this one die. Stand still if you end up on the beam, because if you're moving, you take counter damage, which is a lot more damage. Stop throwing the Molotovs. Did you get her? No. Nope. She's just going to dodge it all up there. So, anyway, here we are. We made it to our lantern. Oh, no, no, no. Come back. Got it. All right, two bloodstone chunks. Uh, so we made it to our lantern. Uh, before we proceed here, we are gonna go head to Upper Cathedral Ward. Our whole point of coming here was to get that key. We definitely have enough to get Very a level well, this time, and we have enough chunks to upgrade our our uh, weapon as well. And we are five away from a level nine Ludwig's Holy Blade. Almost just a hair under 600 fire damage. That is just ridiculous. Um, where are we going? Oh, yeah. Upper Cathedral. So we have one more of our tools to get before we have all the ones that we really want. Well, I say that there's another one that's decent. Um, not a must have, but that's much, much later. Uh, you have to go through research to get that.
Ooh, wrong way. You say anything different yet? Oh. Nope. She'll disappear at some point. I don't remember what triggers her. If it's any boss, if it's a certain boss. Uh, but she'll go away, uh, and then we'll go track her down and finish her quest line. We want to take the shortcut. Um, actually, no, we didn't. We already did this in a much earlier episode. My bad. I've played through so many times, sometimes I forget what I've done and what I haven't. We're not really interested in any of these guys. They're not a threat, a challenge, or anything in between. fire you take the fire and now it's time for creepy baby things I don't I don't know what these are but they are ugly and creepy and I just I don't I don't know this game's really weird man I mean I dig it but it's really weird Some blue elixir that can always come in handy. Let's top off here because sometimes if they get their arcane off, they can be a handful. Alright, not too big a deal today. Creepy baby things? What's interesting about these ones over here is they all seem to be going somewhere to do something and I haven't figured out what it is yet. They're they're staring up. There's some birds up there, but other than that, I, I just don't know what's going on. I mean, clock tower, maybe? I don't know. Great Lake Rune. I will kill him. They're too creepy. Frenzied cold blood. Okay, so we are approaching 30 minutes. We'll uh, stop progressing here shortly. Uh, I don't. Uh, I don't much care for this guy uh, in general with the sickle. Oh, just out of range. What a shame. Only one of them hit him. Oh, wow. He got me one time. Fool me once. You know the saying. George Bush ruined it. 
You ain't gonna fool me again. Oh, this place is lovely. So, uh... I think I'll go grab some nicotine. Uh, no, I'm not a smoker. I am a vapor. But, uh, before we start this place, I am gonna need a little dose of nicotine. So, uh... I'll go do that. We're at 30 minutes, and uh, if you enjoyed it, uh, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. And in the next episode, we'll be uh, working our way through here, getting to the Celestials. So uh, join me in the next video, and thanks for watching.